Saturday afternoon, we're out pulling a couple yards of honey. Uh, the crew has the weekend off, except for Carrie. Uh, typically what we do is on the weekends, um, we use them to get caught up with work. Uh, just to work around the edges, just to get ready for the week ahead. Just to make sure that uh, everything stays on schedule and uh, keep everything productive. Uh, so we're just getting a couple yards pulled right now which we didn't get to last week because the honey's coming in pretty heavy, kind of slowed us down a little bit. So we have two yards we're gonna pull on today. And then uh, then I'll probably, then we're gonna start uh, graft tomorrow. We're gonna set up a builder today and we're gonna start uh, uh, making up queen cells. These queen cells are gonna be used to uh, repair hives that we lose through the summer. And we're gonna make up a few uh, summertime uh, nukes just with the brush bees off the windows in the hot room. So that's what we're up to. Here's Carrie, she comes in, I called her in this afternoon and again for tomorrow afternoon. So we're setting up another builder and what we're doing is we've chosen this hive, this is the chosen hive, to make our cells for the summer. <laughs> and we're just simply, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna shake all the bees from the top boxes, so we're shaking the production out of it. The excluders here so the queens down there we know we're just going to shake all these bulk bees into our builder if we don't think that's enough bees we'll take from the, the neighboring hive here too we're going to make sure there's lots of bees in here lots of young bees to make our cells so this should yield us roughly 30 cells every four days so this is what we're after lots of bulk bees We'll just let these guys get settled in the box before we go. We got to take these uh, skateboards off, and then uh, and then we're gonna bring these guys back home. Just out in this nuke yard, which I had set out earlier, uh, these are the five framers that we put together underneath uh, our honey box equipment. Not as neat and tidy as the six framers, but um, it works. I prefer the six framers, they're, they're a little more user friendly and they fit the uh, boxes on top a lot better. And they just add one more frame of space and the sixes seem to make all the difference on wintering. These guys are just a little bit tight, but it works quite well. And as you can see, they are packing this box full of honey. So the canola flow is just about done. They're working in alfalfa. We have a sunflower field. We grow, we grow sunflowers and it's just coming into bloom. So we're just putting some equipment on top to catch the sunflower flow. And yeah, we'll drop this truckload onto this yard and then come back in about 10 days and harvest the bounty of honey.